and welcome to Damage Noted, which is my show. I'm Giovanni Spezzacatena, also known as Rabbit Eye. This show is on till the end of December 2021. My background is in animation and in graphic design, but also have done a lot of motion graphics and web design and have taught as well. My education goes back to Montreal, where I went to college and then university, and I gained an MFA in film animation. Also, I taught there for a couple of years. I moved on to Seattle, where I taught full-time at the Art Institute of Seattle, where I taught interactive arts and design, and also flash animation. I've always painted and drawn and made little cartoons and flip books and such since I was probably seven or eight years old. I really started focusing on painting in about 1999. I started investigating what I liked, which uh, tended to be the traditional Japanese aesthetic of wabi-sabi, which is basically an outcome of Zen Buddhism and the traditional culture, the visual philosophies grounded in Zen. Using materials that will typically be natural and also be uh, very much worked upon. So texture and color are very much my concerns. My work has tended to be on wood, cradled wood panels are called, and I will often gouge into them as well. I'm using um, copper and iron patina. It's almost like a pigment that you can paint on and uh, successive layers. I've dealt with collage for many, many years. My work is always engaged with natural shapes and textures. My materials tend to, again, to be natural ones to minimize environmental impacts, such as uh, wood, copper, beeswax, rust, and copper patinas. It will also be accompanied by natural pigments like walnut-based ink and also conventional acrylics and watercolor paints, uh, though often applied in a diluted form. I will also use unusual products like cyanotype on wood or paper to create for example, deep blues. Aesthetic also often includes repurposing items like driftwood, string, bits of text ripped from discarded books, uh, or leaves, plant life, images from discarded magazines, hardware elements, which all indirectly point to the environment and human effects on it. My ultimate goal is to produce a visual harmony and the atmosphere that can range from calm to contemplative to even violent. Uh, but in unusual ways, through the use of shapes, pattern, color, materials, texture, and collage elements to make the viewer think. One of my most used tools in production is a single blade razor, which I use to gouge, smooth, scrape, etch, or apply paint, or other materials, or paper resulting marks are maybe reminiscent of machine reproducing wearing into materials over time. So what I would say would be to approach my work with an open mind and try to spend a little bit of time with the pieces, and they're there to really be sat with a little bit. They will change, as any artwork will, but more pronounced here because of the textures. They'll change a lot with the lighting and the way you look at them. If you would like to inquire about owning some of these pieces for your own, please reach out to me at rabbiteye.com. I hope you enjoy the show.